What is going on guys? Pablo here back again with another unboxing. We have hella hats to unbox today. Over 10 plus hats. Not as big as the first one, but still a lot of hats to unbox today. We got a lot of packages from the US that came in. A lot of SF Giants. I think this might be a majority SF Giants unboxing. But yes, let's jump right into the unboxing. So oh, first package up is actually not gonna be a hat. It's actually gonna be a pin from Stone Cold Fitness. If you know Stone Cold Fitness, he makes dope ass beer can pins and it's really sick but he is also known for making wwe belt pins which he first did but he also recently just did uh, making championship rings and oh my god this one's a straight up beauty right here you got that w that championship ring the bulls pin ring right there looking so nice you got the diamonds and you also got the glitter really dope pin this might be my new favorite pin i ain't gonna lie it's really dope so now that i've shown you the pin let's get into the first hat of the day so I do apologize, well I don't even apologize actually because I'm a Giants fan but all of the packages today are going to be all SF Giants, the ones from the US specifically. The ones from Toppers, we do have other teams. Starting off from Pro Image Sports, NorCal, we got that SF Giants high fee. Oh my god guys, this one is a beauty. I got this one uh, as an assist, I did think it would sell out but it didn't. I got it for a good price assist anyways. So you got this beautiful olive white with some metallic silver uh, visor right here. And you got a purple under visor right here. On the logo, you do have that Giants all in that lime green with that metallic silver on the ball with purple stitching looking also nice. And on the side patch, you got that 1984 All-Star Game side patch full of metallic silver and the purple and green hits right there. This is really great. You do have that flat batterman with that metallic silver and purple on the back as well. And this hat, I forgot to mention, is made in China and 100% poly. Super sick hat and as a Giants fan, I'm glad I got this one in my collection. Continuing the trend, copying from Pro Image Stockton, we got another banger from Pro Image Stockton right here. So second hat up from Pro Image Stockton, let's see what we got in the back. We got that upside down SF and oh my god, this one is a beauty right here. So this one is part of the Yu-Gi-Oh collection. I think this was the left or right arm or something like that. I do have the other SF, which is the upside, which is the properly flip logo. And I'm gonna put a picture right here. And yeah, so let's just get into the hat real quick. You got the SF upside down logo, which you rarely see on hats. So I love this, it's very nice detail custom. You got that weed visor. And um, on the side patch, you have that 1984 All-Star Game side patch and that metallic silver hit with the orange on the side. Looking also clean, also nice. And one of my favorite features on this hat, you got that icy blue UV. This is just a sick hat. And I'm just glad I have this one also in my collection and um, you know, can't miss out on the Yu-Gi-Oh pack. Last one up, coming up from Pro Image Smarts, NorCal or Stockton. I don't know which one they go by, but we do have the SF and A's, the Yu-Gi-Oh head collection. I mean, sorry, the Yu-Gi-Oh collection, but this is the head of the blue ice dragon or something like that. Man, this hat is truly one of a kind right here. You got that SF, you got the A's, you know, that rivalry, the Battle of the Bay, purple under visor, blue, visor right here and you got the sf and ace all in full metallic with that battle of the pay side patch looking also sick this is just a must have in my opinion if you are a giants collector next package up is actually from lids hd my race shipper did actually put it in together with the last package so let me just show you guys real quick we got that lids hd camel pack right here that giants that ball logo my favorite logo right there looking also nice yeah, you got a bit of metallic silver hits on it. And then you got that 2007 All-Star Game side patch on the side. Looking also crips, also clean. Black visor, classic Kelly Green under visor. White guts and a flat Batterman on the back. And this hat again is made in China. Next package up is again, I'm sorry, from Pro Image Norkel. I forgot I had one more and this was assisted because I did think it would sell out, but it didn't. But hey, it's all good at the end of the day. We have that two-tone e40 hyphy ox pack so this was the last one and i managed to complete the whole hyphy pack right here you got that beautiful sf logo right there with the green the green sorry and a bit of bronze and that black corduroy on the visor right there which is very unique but i think the most unique part about the hat is the under visor you got that tiger camel right there super sick 
I think this is my only hat with the Tiger Camo under visor. And you got that 2000 inaugural season side patch right there for the San Francisco Giants with a lot of metallic hits. Great hat right here and great hook to E40's album. Next package shop is gonna be from Hat Club or U a Dub. We have the Monaco collection and man, this hat is clean right here. We got that peach visor and the peach SF logo right there. And then you got that uh, 1984 All-Star Game side patch on the side with a bit of metallic hit again. And the thing that is significant about this hat and why it costs $60 retail is that under visor. Man, look at that, look at that shine, you got that satin uv that wine red satin uv and this two-tone right here when i first saw pics of this hat i was wondering if this was going to be an off-white but now i finally receive it in hand it's definitely much more of a white than an off-white um it is like more of an off -white. it's like a white stone not 100 percent optic white color if you guys know what i mean but this is still a sick hat and a beautiful hat right here so i could get free shipping i did add in the sugar shack pin as well just so I can get that free shipping. Make sure you guys do that when you guys order from Hat Club. So the last package coming in from the US today is gonna be from my boy, Lil Bit of Luck. I'm, you saw him, I mentioned him in the first unboxing video and he did assist me for the ECAP CD drop which had two Giants in it. And first up, I'm gonna show you this Giants right here. And this is low key like a Warriors crossover, I would say. You got that stone right here, the SF with the blue and the yellow details on the back. And then you got a 2000 inaugural side patch right there with metallic hits with some yellow in it and a gray under visor, that good gray under visor. On the back, you do have a flat batter mat and the hat is actually gonna be made in China, 100% polyester. Man, this hat was just too clean. I could not pass on this one. The last one out from the US is this hat right here, the SF Giants, again with the 2000 inaugural side patch. I guess ECAP CD just loves using the side patch for some reason. And then we have the SF logo, the double logo, same logo as the other one. And you have the brown right here with a bit of like pink metallic hits on the back on detail, brown visor, and you got like a sand uh, under visor right here. Man, this one was another clean one. I think both hats are just super clean and yeah, as a Giants collector, you just need both in your collection. Now that we've unboxed all the hats from the US, it's time to unbox some from Europe, specifically toppers. So coming up first from toppers, is actually gonna be two hats, guys. And this was uh, both a restock. Well, one of it was the first one. So I'm gonna show you the restock first. We have that Seattle Mariners, or some, some might have said the reverse Lawson. And yeah, look at this beauty, man. You got that S Seattle right there, that Ken Griffin Seattle Mariners logo. Looking also clean, also nice, with metallics, slow, low key metallics, more like pearlescent stitching on the front on the ass. You have that 30th anniversary Mariner side patch with lovely detailing, just packed with metallic stitching on the side. And the icy blue metallic under visor. Man, this hat is just super clean, super simple. And again, I'm glad to have this one in my collection. Second hat up is gonna be the Texas Rangers. Dirk Nowitzki, Pat's favorite player, a European player, basketball player, the legend. And you have that final season side patch to show the final season he played in the Dallas Mavericks. And that was in 2019, I think. That's why he put the 2019 side patch. You, so you have that T right there, looking also clean, also nice. Blue under visor, Kelly green under visor. And you got a lot of metallic hits on the side patch with the better man on the back. And this hat is actually gonna be 100% poly and made in China. Man, this hat is just a beauty right here, beauty. So this is gonna be the final hat of the day. It's gonna be from Toppers. It dropped this week actually. It is the Texas, the Golden Glove. Oh my God, guys, just look at this hat. Oh my God, this might be one of my favorite Toppers hat in a while with that Serpientes. Look at that Texas T logo right there, packed with metallic gold stitching and the red uh, stitching on the back on the details as well and on that side patch you got that 40th texas and every side patch packed with more metallic and uh, you got a brown visor and a red under visor right here this is the texas golden glove but in my opinion i'm calling this the texas twix this looks very similar to the twix candy guys i'm gonna put a comparison picture right above somewhere here and you can see the comparison 
But yeah, guys, this is just a beautiful hat. Oh my God. I'm... So guys, that's going to be it for me. Those were all the hats and the one pin that we unboxed today. As you can see here, here's all the hats that I have that I unboxed today. Count them up and let me know down below how many hats they are. Uh, yeah, a lot of dope hats. A lot of Giants hat in specific as I am a Giants collector. Thank you guys. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Please do make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you did enjoy the video. Comment down below if you have any questions. I'll do my best to get back to all of them. And thank you guys so much again for watching. This has been your boy Pablo Collect. And I'm signing out. Peace.